Team Team He, Team She. Is it because you feel an affinity towards uh? Does the heart lay over here? <laughs> Aaron, you've never been on the vlog before. No, dude. What's so, going on here? So, so this is the, the vlog. This is the vlog. This is, the 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 this the is happening. What? <laughs> what is this? That is an that incredible is phone, crazy. huh? Some alien technology. Alien technology. I'm so confused. Which one is this? The Samsung. It's like Galaxy sidekick, Galaxy. sidekick got on yeah. crack. I don't yeah. know what's happening. Is it really? The iPhone. Love you guys. Oh. Bobby and Amy right Okay, okay. No! Wait, it's not telling! It's not telling! <laughs> That's what I felt. Oh, man. Yes, dude. On this video for like more than 30 seconds. So, how's it feel? What? Yeah, I know it's gonna be a boy. Great. I knew it. You know I had two dreams. dreams. I knew it too. Oh, you did? Yeah, yeah. High five. <laughs> Apparently, Harrison didn't want to hang out with me. Uh, so guys, it, today's uh, Tuesday, November 5th, and uh, I turned 30 today. Wow. So there's like a lot to unpack when it comes to my birthday. Uh, starting with the day my birthday actually on. So born on November 5th, which like, I feel like according to pop culture and news and everything, everyone knows what November 5th is, it's Guy Fox Day. But growing up, before the movie V for Vendetta came out, uh, I had no idea what Guy Fox Day is. So it was always so funny when my dad would say, hey, birthday's on Guy Fox Day. I'm like, cool. Another holiday I've never heard of. <laughs> and uh, then I saw V for Vendetta. Then was super uh, happy that my birthday was on November 5th. <laughs> uh, so I, I think it, uh, Goes without saying, I have probably the coolest birthday day ever. Um, so every single year when it's my birthday, we have a V for Vendetta themed party on Friday, this Friday, uh, first like weekend. So we normally, you know, today's Guy Fox Day, but everyone's working, so we'll do it on Friday. <laughs> So what's interesting specifically about this birthday compared to the last 29 <laughs> birthdays I've had is that uh, I'm turning 30. Um, and that's obviously a big milestone, right? Everyone calls it the dirty 30, all those things like that. Um, but it's, I think it's especially interesting to me because of one fact and it's this like cloud of mystery. You feel like you're getting old now. And it's always said like everything after 30 is downhill. Uh, so. I mean, that remains to be seen, so we'll see if that is true. These, these guys uh, decided to come uh, hang out with me on my birthday. Bad decision. <laughs> it wasn't by choice either, you forced us. Yeah, you're right. I can't, I can't do that on film. <laughs> the brand of Hobnob. That, that is not the Hobnob play. That is not our freaking image right now. Oh, oh, you want to do it one more time? It's like. Oh, I'm just going to get the big hair. I'll be your Friday. Friday. Yeah, Friday. Dude, everybody's going to be Friday. Everybody's going to be Friday. Friday. You're going to be Friday. Friday. Yeah, Friday. Friday. Well, guys, it's. uh. Day one, official day one, being 30. Birthday is officially over before party on Friday. Just back to normal life, I guess. So, you know, like, if anything reflecting on turning 30 has done anything for me over the last 24 hours, has just been that you reflect on how far that you've come and how what sort of experiences you've gone through, what sort of things you've learned over the last 30 years. Because, man, there's a lot. <laughs> like, it's crazy to think 14, you know, more than 16 years ago, I started DJing. 
and I didn't know what time zones were and I had to learn what those were and now look what I do look where I am and uh, it's just mind-blowing to me so over the last like month or so I've been moving my desktop computer from the office the living room because I have a, my VR set up and I've been wanting to play in here more often. So I decided I'm going to build a new computer. So uh, as a birthday present to myself, I uh, bought a bunch of parts and I'm building my first mini ITX build, which uh, I'm stoked for. So uh, <laughs> let's uh, build some uh, epic computers. Well guys, uh, it's another travel day, and uh, today I'm off to uh, St. Augustine, Florida for another work event. Made it to Jacksonville, it's actually really cold here, and uh, now starts the hour-long journey down to St. Augustine. I must say, I've never been to Jacksonville before. The airport's nice. Yeah, for everyone who wants to know, we're here for, it's a tech company that essentially um, is having one of their meetings. They have a little small meeting, it's called Round Tables, hence why the tables are all round. It's like 6 a.m. and uh, the client event tailwind kind of starts at around 7 and just heading down there again today mainly playing just mainly client meet and greet so uh, luckily I don't have to like run any gear or really do much I just want to make sure their event starts off okay and then I'm gonna go post up in a Starbucks for the day and uh, crank out some work back at the airport uh, shows all done super successful super smooth learning to show um, yeah I'm excited to get back to Phoenix uh, it's November and currently I only have two or three more trips left in the year it's crazy to think how little travel I have left 